What's up viewers, Intarian here, and today I'm going to bring you a modded Minecraft playthrough. In this mod pack, I'll be playing Hexit. Hexit's made by uh, the same people who made Tekkit, or the Technic Pack people. Uh, there's a ton of mods added in here, they'll be in the description. Um, what the heck? Uh, good chance I will probably have them on the screen right now you can or just you can just look in the description but either way it adds it has more of an adventure aspect Ooh, look at all these stalagmites oh wait stalag stalag my select what i i don't i'm trying to think of like the, the i don't never mind but anyway it adds more of an adventure aspect instead of the machine building aspect of the Maybe of Tech It and Feed the Beast. If, if you ever played Tech It, you know it's really machine oriented. This is more just adventure and it's kind of Divine RPG like, but it's a little different. I like Divine RPG, but it's 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 a bit weird. I don't know. I've, I'm not a big fan of mod packs that have Mistcraft in them. Really confused with that. Kind of. Well, not really confused per se, but I'm just not like a big fan of it. But, uh, this seems to be really good from from what I've seen of it. It has one of my favorite mods because it eliminates the dumb need to cut wood, especially during Let's Plays. Let's make an axe right now. Okay. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Uh, bam. It just takes it down. I want to go find a big old biome. Let's take this with us. Not a big old biome, a big old tree biome. Gosh, no, my mouse bad. Let's get over here. Let's see what happens when I hit these. What does that give me? Ooh, an orchid. Or, yeah. L luxuriously soft. Luxuriously. Oh, I can't say that word right now. Is that a penguin? Oh my god. It's a penguin. It's so awesome. Oh, that's not, that's not cool. Oh! What the heck? They're aggressive. Holy crap, that's awesome. I thought they were all gonna start like attacking me. I was gonna be scared. Don't know what that is. Oh, what the heck? Did you just give me another heart? Oh my gosh, this is awesome. This freaking mod pack so far is awesome. But let's just start cutting down these trees. That just shows how many arrows I have. Wow, it's awesome. Because arrows are, I guess, important. But let's. Let's see if this heals hunger. Nope. Now, I don't even know what this is. No, it also has the raw flesh to... Um, raw flesh to leather mod. So that's pretty freaking awesome, because I hate... I mean, rotten flesh, not raw flesh. Rotten flesh. Let's see what kind of trees these are. Sakura saplings. This is awesome. Let's cut down some more trees. What? What? Because it's touching stuff. Oh, great. I think I probably have enough. Let's see how it looks. Oh, wow. It actually changes the look of that. That is awesome. Gives us some sticks. I like how wood actually affects it. Now, let's actually see if I can make if the chest look different. Then the mod is, has me sold. Or has me bought, I guess you could say. Nope, doesn't. I, that was such a delayed reaction. But <laughs> I just didn't think to react. Let's. <clears throat> Blueberries! Blueberries! Oh my gosh. Oh, this is gonna give me hearts. Emerald shards. Can I make an emerald with it? No. I think I probably need nine. What's this? Barley. Am I gonna make beer? I think that'd be actually a pretty cool thing. Not the cheap, like. Let's get some more. No hearts? Why what a bully. Let's I'm actually planning on making eyes. I usually do. Ooh, ooh, a village. As I usually do, I plan on making. Aww. 
My house is in um, mountain biomes. What the heck is this thing doing? I'm probably just going to go over here in this extreme hills biome because I love extreme hills. But yeah, I think, I mean, I might as well because I don't know, I just like it a lot, even though most of my series will probably be in extreme hills. I, uh, I like extreme hills. They're, they just, there seems to be more you can do almost with them. Like, um, Obviously, with flat land, you can do a, quite a bit of stuff. What is that redstone just sitting out there? Whatever. Obviously, with um, planes, you can build whatever the hell you want. But for me, excuse me, I tend to be. Um, I, I I mean, I tend to find it. I oh, sorry, I had to cut it, but uh, I tend to find it a little bit harder to just build in. Uh, what's it called? And just regular old. Uh, Planes biomes because I tend to just build square houses. And let's see if I get whoa, a little bit of lag. Heart, what does it do? I don't know what that does. Okay, ah, oh, so beautiful. That's I me. Mean, I like this air area. I'm not sure. Oh shit, probably just crashed. Oh no, I didn't. This game, while it's um, generating, it's gonna be really slow. What the heck is this? What the? There's just a skeleton head. A skeleton skull. That's really strange. Bird! I hit it. Do a little more exploring. Ooh, a village. Yes, I can make my town. My, my town, my house right near a village. I do love this area. Ooh, what the heck? Nice old treehouse. This is, honestly, this mod is really freaking awesome. Let's... What I see, I mean, I'm not sure if it has no creatures in it. For one, I would guess it does, but I think I'm gonna have to say I'm wrong. Okay, actually, I need those carrots now, don't I? No, I don't. I don't know why. I guess I couldn't sprint where I... Right... But actually, hmm. Well, I guess I should build. Well, I think let's see. Let's check out. We'll see this first off. What? Among the first edition of materials and you. So on the first day, we're on with these pages. You find the first steps. What's this? A stencil table. Okay. Well, let's 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 secure our house first before I start going into all that. Hmm, I'm not sure if I want to build another mountaintop house, because that's what I'm cons that's what I'm probably going to do in, uh... I mean, it's going to be totally different in Clockwork, so... Who cares? Let's break... Nope, let's not break it. Let's go down. What's in here? Oh! Uh, look at this guy! A silver nugget for a copper nugget. That's my chair. Um, bone binding. Oh my gosh. Copper axe head. Okay, cool. Well, let's not take that away. I need that, too. I'll take... Simple stuff away. Okay, cool. Wait, what's this say right here? Gosh, the noise is so annoying. Um, I should just had sticks. Perkage this. Does it make it a copper axe? Maybe I need two to make a copper axe. But uh, yeah, actually, I think I'm going to. What the? That's a bird. I thought that was a fairy. I thought that was Raina, 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 Raina from Divine RPG. Let's hop up here. Okay, let's bring it up here. Yeah, I think I do like this a lot. Like, just above. Yeah, because it seems to be kind of a straight. It seems to be very oh, steep on every side, isn't it? Heck yeah. These are my favorite type of mountains. The ones that uh, just shoot up just randomly, and then you don't. Yeah, this is awesome, because look at that. Look at the way this village generated. This village is awesome. Oh, what's up here? Who is one of these things they can feed the beast that generated flux? Oh! Oh, no! I'm not going to jump in. I'm scared. 
Oh god. Okay. But anyway, I'm gonna settle down real quick and then uh, I'll probably cut to the stent table, tell you what all that does. This episode's gonna be short. And bo oh, another village over there. Oh no, wait, is that the thing I just saw? I don't know. But the beginning will just be was just me exploring because that's all it's gonna be in the beginning because I need to learn the mod, mod as well. But I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, so we're back and I did a little bit of a investigating more on the mod. Not as much on the internet as just on What the heck? Oh, I forgot they catch you on fire. No, 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 no. Okay, thank God. Whew. I need damn sheep right now, I just realized. At least I can can I sit a damn it. How do I say the Green Hills? Oh no wonder this thing is so awesome. Uh, that's why I love this biome, because it's green. I love green biomes. What? What's going on here? There you go. Oh, man, I love those. Like the nice jungle-looking grass and all the hills. This is perfect for me. I just didn't even realize why I loved it so much, but now I do. But anyway, I did some investigating and figured out that, um... <clears throat> figured out a few things. Let me just check to see if this thing's still up. Yeah, it is. First of all, I'm not even sure this does more damage, but it seems to dig a little faster, doesn't it? No, it doesn't. I just move down here a little bit. I'll be building stuff on the top, of course, later. Let's dump this crap in there. It's not going to look neat at all. But I will plant these blueberry bushes. And then show you. And maybe build, I'm going to build a stencil table. Investigate. Oh, great. Thanks, big guy. Okay. No! There you go. I'm gonna build a stencil table. And then. End the episode. But so. Let's grab this mysterious book. Okay, so basically, what this is about is just teaching you the basics of this. You can build the shape and material on a part builder tool workshop. Together, these three. So. A stencil table. You wanna start like that? Come on. There you go. And then, like that. Okay. And with the stencil table, let's just put it here. How do you make patterns? Let's go back into this book. Part crafter, tool station. What does this make? Grout, seared brick, seared brick, smeltery. Okay, okay, okay. Pattern chest. Okay, wait, what? So, okay, so basically, this here you make patterns. And then, oh, what's this right here? Materials and you. Tools. You have a guide and ability, tools and abilities. Within these pages, you will details and random tool modifier material detail per different thing. A few the book is meant to copy. Updates whenever the original has been modified. Check back occasionally for information on new things. Head tool rod. Shovel head. Class precision tool. What is the name? Grab on snow. Okay. Oh. Frying pan. Dang. So obviously, I know I'm going fast, but I'm probably you guys probably don't. Well, I guess I can. So basically, awesome, awesome, awesome. If you need to look at them, just pause and stuff. But I'm getting a getting the the, the gist of things. Oh, all these different weapons and stuff. Okay. Click on that. No, I can't. Can be refined and processed. I wonder if you refine it the same way, though. Okay, so this is just kind of showing you what you can get from it. Aluminum, bug, blue slime, green slime, slimy mud. Okay. Well, this is mostly helpful for figuring out the damage and handle modifier and all that crap. Oh, that's so cool. Oh 
my gosh, you can add all this crap like luck. What is that? Auto smell? Auto repair? Mmm. That is so cool. So, of course, I need to figure out the things that you. I'm gonna exit out of that for now, but. Uh, of course, that will never leave the series because I'm gonna need to use that a lot, but this here. I'm not really sure what I do. I think you put maybe. I honestly don't know. I need to look that up. I'm not sure if it's in the book or not, but. Tool station. Okay, well, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to make that in the next episode. I will show you this. Um, th this is really cool. This is awesome. But what I was going to. I also was going to show you is when I'm looking up. Axe. Wait, no, here you go. Copper axe head, right? To make it, it's. It's um. It's it's pretty hard because you actually have to smelt it, which is smelty in itself looks confusing as crap. But uh, to make I don't think it's no such as a handle. It's a rod, and I do not think that you can use wood rods. And I don't know why, but it doesn't it doesn't really show how to make well wood rod. I'm pretty sure it's just wood, but. I don't really know how to make a wood rod. Maybe it's not. Maybe it has to be combined. Yeah, it must have to be combined. Because it stick makes shovel, all that crap. But with iron and stuff, if if I bring out the bone shovel head, can't make it. Because what I'm thinking is you need bone rods. And that really makes has a really cool aspect to the game that isn't there in regular Minecraft. But I'm really freaking excited to, to play this mod more. That's actually dumb. Nah, I need both of these right now. I'm really freaking excited to get to know this mod. I hope you are excited to watch me learn it. But uh, I have to end the episode here, unfortunately, because I um, don't want it running too long. But uh, yeah, thanks for watching. This is Atarion. Leave a like if you liked it, and uh, subscribe if you want to continue watching me play some Hexit. So yeah, see you guys next time.